And that is what they say is that. Is that what they say? I don't remember what they say. Dang it. I wanted to sound way more confident when I opened this. Hey everybody, it's me. Um, big surprise? Probably not. I'm I'm a ball of awkward today. I don't know what it is. Um But uh how are you? How was your August? My August was um kind of not as fun as I'd like it to be. But that's because I can't really go out and cook or do much. But I'm getting better. I'm, I'm standing up for longer and I'm, I'm walking more confidently. And uh, I can use my left hand for more. I'm starting to type on the keyboard with my left hand. And that's that's a big uh, plus. Although I can't quite reach the uh, number keys. Um, they can just kind of hang out on home row and kind of work home row. That's, that's a start. Um, uh, I've got some new exercises I'm doing and um, <clears throat> uh, I've, uh, I'm, I'm off of one of my medications now. I don't have to take quite as much medicine, um, which is a plus, but it didn't start out that way. That was, uh, <laughs> there's a, there's a, I'm, I was ahead and now I'm behind again um, on audios um, because uh, for a while I was like spontaneously getting really, really dizzy like, um, uh, uh, almost like when I was having a hypotensive event there with my heart would just drop in blood pressure and I'd feel faint for a long time. Uh, and it's a scary, scary feeling. I don't know if, if you ever had the feeling like you're going to faint, um, imagine it not going away and it's, yeah, it's, it's bad. It's really, really bad. Um, uh, but the cause of it was that um, my heart is getting stronger and uh, so I don't need as many medicines to make it easier for my heart to work. So uh, I'm off of one of them. Hooray! So that's, that's good news, positive news. I'll take that news. Um, but let's talk about September, shall we? Um, because there's a lot going on and... Um, there's a lot going on in the background too, uh, <clears throat> and you're gonna unfortunately get a little bit less content this month. Um, I'm hoping to not. I'm hoping to have uh, um, stuff on here, but why don't we why don't we take a look? Because I actually have a picture for you guys to see this time, um, and there it is. All right, and as you can see, this Friday you're going to get. The Revival Pole Winner, Friend, uh, Part 2, and it is already recorded, and I'm in the process of editing it and having it ready for tomorrow. Um, and then, as you can see, on the 5th, 12th, 19th, and 26th, you're going to have Improvs, with the 26th being the winner of the sequel poll. And on the 9th, the 16th, the 23rd, you're going to get Specials, um, which I'm going to have... Two of them voted by Patreon members, and one of them will be voted on YouTube, uh, in the community uh, channel, or community board on the channel. Um, and then, of course, on the 30th will be the Amulet series season. Oh, I put that wrong. It's season two, episode two. Disregard the S one. <laughs> you can tell I make these in a hurry, don't you? <laughs> uh, but as you can see, on the 7th, the 14th. The 21st and uh, and while well, the 28th you will get an audio you get that one but you see only the live streams you're not seeing the scripts that is because I am busy at work with Talktober um, and Talktober if you uh, don't know it is a it is where we make audios for the whole month based on short prompts and it'll be 31 days of of uh, an audio every day and that's not including my regular audios so in order for me to do that and keep my schedule I have to start now and I already have about half of it done so huzzah <laughs> um, and with any amount of luck I'll have it all done and we can just coast through October and I will only have to make the regular content and not have to worry about it um, but Talktober is also about um, your uh, 
as it's supposed to, in Australia it's celebrated as a month of telling guys that it's okay to express themselves it's okay to talk about their problems um, and I think that's a good thing I think it's a good thing that anybody talks about their problems so why not include that in some way here now would you like to help me participate in Talktober you absolutely can but you'll have to move fast just like I will during this month if you have the opportunity to make artwork or if you want to write a script based on the prompts which I'll try to get the prompts up here um, you should be seeing them now um, if any of these prompts interest you in either writing a script or writing a or drawing a picture or even participating yourself this is the list that I'm going off of this is not the official list I don't even think there is an official list but it's the one I'm using and I got a lot of likes on Twitter so that's what we're gonna do um, so with that in mind uh, if you have those you can send them to me please try to get them all to me before September 29th because I'm gonna have to start having things uploaded by the 30th okay um, and you're you're allowed to to work on anything and keep it within if you're making artwork I'd love to put it up on the channel as a thumbnail um, if you are making a script I need to have it super early um, but again I will take anything up to the 29th you just send it to my email that is listed in the description below um, and in this particular case please put October 2022 in the subject line so I know what it's about okay um, so with all of that said and done um, I would like to uh, say that as we as kids are starting school and we're getting into the burr months which are wonderful because I was just learning about how some people even start celebrating Christmas this early which I find blasphemous because uh, Halloween is awesome don't skip over it <laughs> but um, but it's it's your it's your thing uh, I hope that you have a wonderful start of fall and that the transition from summer and as we get closer to winter is uh, warm and good for you and uh, it just evokes all the, the fun that I love to have um, yeah <laughs> please be kind to yourself as always um, because you're worth being kind to it's um, it really is uh, a pleasure and an honor to get to talk with you guys and have fun and to just you know do my little part to help make you feel comforted even if it's through a completely fictitious character you know um, I don't I don't get the opportunity to uh, appreciate people that I've wanted to all the time and I think that that's a, a good thing for me to do and it's a good good thing to have done for you and I'm glad you let me so with that all being said Stay brilliant, everybody, and I'll catch you next time.